Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to our backyard garden. I want to do a quick video update for you guys on the previous video, the one that I posted I think two days ago on the uh, fish fertilizer. Uh, what happened when you put down some organic uh, fertilizer, especially something that has an animal base like fish um, that is very smelly. Uh, even though I mentioned in the video that after you diluted the concentrated solution, it doesn't smell as bad. But but when you apply them initially, um, there there is a little strong scent. If I want to put it that way, um, you attract some flies. Not today because that that's two days ago. So so the the soil have time to absorb all the you know smelly stuff. But also, an, an unintended consequence is that you see here, you see that little tiny little burrow, a dig here too, you see that? I can bet you this is a, a, the result of the opossum or the raccoon or even the cat. When they smell the fish, uh, they'll come around and try to dig up some of the stuff, thinking that there might be some food beneath this. Now, I'm not saying that this could happen in you know, every case. But from my experience, um, I, I do come across this from time to time in my garden when I put down fish fertilizer. Um, but what can you do? Uh, this is the backyard, you, you know, animal roam free. Uh, so at night time, uh, when they're hungry, they'll, they'll come around and start, you know, searching for food. That's why, on, on a different note, that's why I don't use, I don't put any animal products such as fish, chicken bone, or any meat product into my compost bin. Uh, even when I bury them, I don't put it down into the ground because the animal can actually, the cat, the possum, they have very heightened sense of smell. They can smell even, they can pick it out even two feet, even 48 inches, or even four feet beneath the soil. And they'll come around and start digging up your, your plants. All right. In this case, it's not too bad. I mean, several inches here. It's not too bad. So I'm just gonna cover it up a little bit, and I'll water it today uh, to you know to dissolve some of the solution. So here we go. So this is just a really uh, quick. I mean, uh, observe observation here uh, that there could be an unintended consequence. Uh, even though the fish fertilizer is an excellent fertilizer, um, again, I don't recommend it used indoor because it's a little smelly uh, and it attracts some flies. So if you use it outdoor in the backyard, I think it's, it's not a big deal. Uh, but if you put too much down um, and too often, then you will invite some critters to come to your backyard. I don't know what uh, what happened here, uh, what animals are digging into this, I don't know, maybe a rat, maybe a possum, maybe a raccoon, uh, or maybe even cats, I don't know. Um, but luckily, you know, my plant didn't get completely destroyed here. Okay, so that's it for our video for today, and uh, thank you for watching, and uh, we'll keep you posting. We posted. Thank you. And please subscribe to our video and please post a comment for me.